so i friend this is amin sorry for this late video but here i will try to provide you the complete review of day 2 and day 3 of ktripali exams and as i have already provided you the day 1 review due to some uh, urgent work i was not able to provide you the video yesterday and day before yesterday but today i am going to provide you the both day review because most of you will appear on 21st 22nd i know because you all want more time for the examination because i know lots of people have done the slot booking for 21st and 22nd so this video is going to help you a lot and soon i will provide you the complete marks versus percentile versus rank versus college all branch that is updated video after the uh, difference in the difficulty level of this year exam and so let's get a start with the review actually both day was similar uh, you can say third day was a little bit more tougher than second day but almost similar some people will say that second day was a little bit tougher some people will say third but according to me as i have uh, discussed with the different type of a student for different shift of the examination it overall if you compare then third day was a little bit difficult so now if you come to the important chapter that is subject wise before that i would like to inform you if your exam is not going well you can contact me for complete counseling and mentorship guidance that is i will be guiding you for the second attempt and also for vit and srm manipal whatever uh, exam you are appearing for across india i will be guiding you to get the best result in all the exams and not only this up to admission is done that is for counseling guidance as well to select the best college so if you want you can contact me there is a nominal charge for that side by you can check the detail as well but once you register it is guaranteed that you will get the best result many of you are having board exam also so how to cope with both the problem at the same time i will be guiding you as i am doing it from last 6 years so now let's get into the point that is difficulty level math is most difficult physics is a little bit tricky chemistry is coming easy as compared to the last year if you say but also in uh, chemistry there is some uh, difficult portion that is from organic chemistry if you have all the command in ncert questions then you will able to solve it because most of the question are coming from the named reaction question so now if we talk about the uh, important chapter that is uh, subject wise then in math permutation combination binomial theorem sequence and series and talk about the geometry side then conic section was there and also from uh, vector and 3d there was maximum question now if you come to matrix determinant there was maximum question from this chapter as well and set relation function complex number and also there was question from a statistics so this these are the important chapter that you need to have more, have in more detail to get more marks in the examination that is i am talking about a triple examination now if you go for physics then modern physics is the best way to score more marks because modern physics cover lots of questions now if you come to the uh, some more chapter in physics then alternating current emi and electrostat and also there is uh, there was question from heat and thermodynamics gravitation and unit dimension and kinematics so these are the chapter that you need to cover from physics now if you come to the chemistry part then organic whole if you know then do otherwise don't because there will be negative mark also if you do uh, wrong question because more chances there to do negative mark in organic part that's why i'm telling if you will do do it in full otherwise don't do and next if you talk about the most easiest part was inorganic because there was some straight forward question from ncert itself so try to study the ncert from hydrogen chapter there was question chemical bonding there was question and also from p block and df block also and coordination compound these are from inorganic and if you come to physical then equilibrium solid state solution uh, chemical kinetics and surface chemistry these are the chapters from where the maximum question has been asked and one more chapter that you don't need to forget that is atomic structure so these are the chapter from which they are asking maximum questions so i will make sure you will study well for the second attempt if you haven't got good result or if you haven't uh, uh, if you haven't done better preparation for this uh, attempt then, then i will be making sure that in the next attempt you will not have this type of problem and you will get the best result so thanks for watching this video please try to subscribe this channel if you want the complete guidance mentorship try to contact me for any type of examination whatever you will appear across india and the important thing is that if you want the complete information and right information at the right time please try to subscribe the channel thank you